defining moment for Georgia. The state legislature passing a hate crime bill. The calls for it were renewed following the death of Ahmad Arbery. The bill taking nearly 500 days and more than a year to win its final victory. It includes harsher penalties for crimes motivated by race, religion, sexual orientation and disabilities. It is now headed to Governor Brian Kemp's desk and his office says that it will be signed pending a legal review. But while that bill awaits the governor's signature, another bill with the added protections for first responders, including police officers, is headed to the state house after passing the Senate. Christy Diaz is live at her home in Fulton County with much more on House Bill 838 and the reaction to it. It's getting closer to passing. Shiva, this is what caused controversy just a couple of days ago with the hate crime bill when wording was inserted to the hate crime bill uh, saying it would protect first responders as a protected class. But after some negotiation, it was taken out of the hate crime bill and well, out of that bill anyway, the wording was instead attached to another bill. HB 838. It says anyone found guilty of targeting a first responder, which is defined as a firefighter, police officer, or a paramedic, could face between one and five years in prison and a fine of up to $5,000. Last night, we spoke to the president of the Georgia NAACP, Reverend James Woodall, who says this is unnecessary since there are already laws on the books to protect police. It's disturbed that as we sat in the Rashad Brooks funeral, that House Bill 838 was passed simultaneously at this kind of parallel signals to us that there's still much more work to be done. So he says that passing the hate crime bill was a win, but now he's calling on four things, repealing the citizen's arrest law, repealing stand your ground, calling on transparency and third party investigations. And now he's calling for the district attorneys who originally were um, in charge of Ahmaud Arbery's case to be banned from prosecuting any other cases until they're being done being investigated. Sheba.